Okay, welcome to this product uh, demonstration video where we're going to show you the uh, new Altair DSD863 which is a direct saliva or midstream, we like to call it direct saliva drug testing kit. We think this design is uh, really going to prove popular because of its ease of operation. There's, there's literally absolutely nothing to go wrong with procedure in running one of these tests on an individual. Short of them having an absolutely dry mouth and no saliva available at all, you are not going to run into some of the issues with other designs of saliva tests where you're collecting inadequate saliva and the samples simply not running through onto the test. So we're showing you the outer packaging here. The DSD863 comes, the full manufacturer's carton for professional users is the CE Mark Boxer 25, shown here. Uh, Manufactured by Hangzhou Oil Test Biotech Company. Catalog code is DSD863. Uh, on the side we'll have the lot number and the expiry date. Uh, carton contains 25 tests. It's a fully CE marked uh, in vitro diagnostics and comes in on a CEO 123 quality serve. Inside the box you get a full data sheet but individually foiled 25 of these which are out of the foil this design. Now this is simplicity itself in a saliva drug test. You've got two membranes each of which will run and give you a control line marked with C and then the drug abbreviations down each side giving you three tests on each column. So this is a six drug test giving you individual results for opiates, cocaine, amphetamine, methamphetamine, benzos and cannabis. It's an ideal combination for most healthcare and workplace screening covers most of the common drug groups that you're interested in as far as drugs of abuse. The ease of operation is this, take it out of the packet, remove the tongue, give it to the donor, puts the teeth around here, wets the tongue with saliva. So it goes directly in the mouth. As soon as it goes into the mouth, you ask the person to put saliva onto it and start your timer. And you're looking at reading your results at between three and five minutes. In most cases, it won't take any longer than 10 minutes to run. The beauty of this is you can actually watch them deliver the saliva into the test, see the test running, you'll see the dye running down these two columns and into the control line. At that stage you can either leave it in the donor's mouth until the control lines of both are, or you can remove it and resheath the test and then read your results at the appropriate time. So there's no chain of custody issues with uh, the sample not coming from the individual that you're looking to screen. The only safety things you have to put in place would be the same as with any other saliva test, i.e. no drinking for 10 or 20 minutes, no smoking for 10 or 20 minutes before you're looking to sample, and nothing else in the mouth at that time. So what we're going to do now is just take this, uh, absorb some saliva onto it, and show you the uh, ease of reading the results in part two.